that? <laughs> Hell yeah! Woo! Good God Almighty! What is going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of Bubble Bubba Bass. And uh, today's video is uh, brought to you by uh, Fitzgerald Fishing with Fitzgerald Fishing Rods. Uh, I got with them a couple weeks ago, and now I got a, a few little goodies to unbox uh, from their company. And uh, I wanted to give a shout out to Fishing with Fitz. Uh, without him, this would not be possible. If you're new here, hit the like and subscribe button. And uh, I'm not gonna, you know, hold y'all too long, so we're gonna get right into the video. All right, guys, we're gonna get into this box. See what we got in here. All right, we have some paper. Oh, oh snap. We got a free hat. That's that's sick. Thank y'all for sending me this hat. That is sick, dude. We got three Fitzgerald stickers. That is freaking awesome, dude. Freaking awesome. Wow. Three stickers, a hat. I got my face guard. This thing's like high quality, dog. Fitzgerald fishing. Then they got the emblem up top here. This thing is nuts, man. High quality stuff right out the box. Not playing around. I know we don't talk good about stuff unless I really like it. And even Shinbo knows that. All right, so now we're gonna get to this seven zero to one right-handed stoner reel by Fitzgerald fishing. Let's see how this bad boy is. This thing looked sick when I looked at it. Hold on. This retails for $140 online. Oh, this thing's butter. They got a sick grip that's not a full circle going all the way around. It's got uh, like a, a tapered spot where your thumb and your index finger can go to reel. And then it's really smooth, compact, fits your hand. I like the black look. I love the black, the, like the matte black look. Uh, this holds uh, 12 pound test, it goes up to 165 yards. That's a little bit more than a normal reel. Um, two, uh, eight pound test for 220 yards. That's a substantial amount of line on one rod. And then um, the clicker doesn't make any noise, but that's fine. And uh, gotta figure out how to get this, uh, get this plate off here. There we go. It's got a sick brake system in there. Yeah, so the it's a brass inside. inside layout. You always want brass in your reels. And um, it clicks in just like that. It's a sick reel. It doesn't feel cheap as a, you know, a normal $100 reel. Like I said, this thing retails for $140, so I'm really impressed by this, actually. Seven to one gear ratio for ball bearings. And that's the that's the Stunner Reel by Fitzgerald Fishing. This is what I've really been waiting for, guys. I'm gonna get into this rod here. Uh, see if I can get this thing opened. Dude, I'm blown away they sent me that hat, dude. Dude, they don't play when they ship these rods, bro. Alright guys, so basically uh, what's going on here is this is in a freaking tube of PVC, which is awesome because it's not no cardboard junk like a normal rod company. And then, uh, like, it's as Shinbone would call it, it's like Fort no getting into Fort Knox. Like, if you don't got a tank or like, you know, some type of like, uh, I don't know. Machete. Machete. <laughs> oh wait, I do got one, but it can't cut PVC. But uh, it's like Fort Knox getting this thing. Like there's stuff like stuffed all in here with the rod so it doesn't move around. So uh, if your rod's broken, I'm pretty sure it went through a tornado. So uh, this is brought to you by duct tape. Freaking awesome. If I can get this thing undone here. There we go. Yeah, get this cap off here. Uh-oh, got her out. Let's 
see what this is. I think this is the paperwork for this bad boy. Now y'all keep in mind, I got a tournament tomorrow and this thing's gonna get put to use. All right guys, so I got this sick rod out of the PVC, right? This is also a Fitzgerald Fishings rod. Now, this is a Okeechobee, uh, the original series. And also, it is a seven foot six heavy. And as y'all know, y'all see me fish a lot of seven foot six heavy poles. But I can tell, like this thing's got a little bit more weight to it, but I think it's because it's got all this plastic on it. So like, I'm not too worried about that yet. But when you envision this without the plastic on it, it feels like it's light as a feather. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this plastic off, get the reel on it, and we're gonna see uh, how much this thing weighs. So stay tuned. Go ahead and give a good shot at the reel seat. Now see how it says Fitzgerald Fishing. The Okeechobee rod, seven foot six heavy. It holds to a half to two ounce weight with 20 to 80 pound braid. What rod do you see that has 20 to 80 pound braid? You put 30 pound braid on a regular pole that's like, you know, $100 or so, you'll break your stuff off. Wear the eyes out. Wear the eyes out too. Now, what exactly. also is awesome is these eyelets, they got a tapered inside. As you can see there, it's tapered inward. It's not like where the line can get stuck on the outside of it. Look at the meat on those. Yeah. Good God. Dude, this wrap job is like beyond, I'm blown away. Elliot, fishing with Fitz. Dude, I'm not gonna lie to you, dude. I was I was like a little skeptical of like leaving a ducket, but um, it's kind of like, you know, got me by the lip, you know what I'm saying? And the rod keep is sick. I don't have to bury my- Stainless steel rod keep. It's stainless steel rod keep. I don't have to worry about burying my hook in it. I can just kind of click it. Dude, that is nuts. So this is the TOR 76H, which means it's the Okeechobee rod. Seven foot six heavy, and dude, this reel feels amazing. I just want to thank Fishing with Fitz and Fitzgerald Rods again. Like, this is awesome. Like, from the looks and the feel of it, I would go ahead and say and get you one, but um, I, I really got to go put this thing to the test before I actually want to say I give up. You know, I don't want to say give up, but. I actually just want to go put this thing to the test because like, dude, I just, I'm going to string this thing up with some braid, dude, and I'm going to, I'm going to let her eat. <laughs> so, uh, once again, if you're new to the channel, uh, hit that like and subscribe button. Also, go check out Fitzgerald Rods. They will be in the link below. They're also in my link tree, uh, um, page with all my sponsors. Also, give a shout out to Monster Bass. And before I do anything, I'm gonna put this uh, Fitzgerald hats, Fitzgerald rods hat on my head. I don't got a shin bone noggin, so I gotta, you know, put a couple clicks up. But, uh, but yeah, man. So these stickers are gonna go on the boat, and uh, these these are some high quality stickers, man. Like, how many did you get? Three. Three. Put one on the truck too. They're like a foam, like a foam rubber. That's the other guy calling. If they eat it, we eat it. <laughs> <laughs>